Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. My name is Darlene. Today I'm going to be reviewing this product right here, but let's go ahead and get right into this. So it is by that brand right there, and it is a brow lamination kit. So when you open it up, this is going to be everything that comes in here. So inside this box, you'll get all of this stuff. You have your little applicators, your scissors, some spoolies, some swabs, just to apply everything with. So it tells you step by step right here on what to do. So the first step is to cleanse, to remove oil, dirt, makeup, residue on eyebrows. So this is the cleanser right here. So let me go ahead. I'm just going to use one of these to clean it off with. which I did just get out of the shower. That's why my hair is wet. Just make sure that I got all the oil off. So step two, you apply a thin layer of glue onto eyebrows, comb brow into the skin in direction and shape you desire using a brush. So now we're gonna get the glue, which is this right here. And then you're just going to apply this to your brows is a thin layer. I'm going to get my spoolie and you're going to put them into the shape that you want to keep. So I'm going to keep this side like this. Let me go ahead and do this eye and then I'll show you what to do next. Okay, so now that my brows are where I want them, I'm going to get the Permine Solution. And it, everything says what it is like on the bottle. And it smells like Permine Solution. Like it smells like if you were getting your hair permed. So now I'm just going to apply this. And now I'm gonna let this sit for eight to 10 minutes and then I'll show you what to do next once I'm done. Okay, so it has been sitting on for 10 minutes. So now I'm going to remove it. So I'm just getting, what did I do with that? I'm just getting the little one that I used to clean my brows and I'm just gonna kind of get the extra product off. Okay, and now I'm going to apply the setting, which is the blue one. And then we're going to apply this on top of the brows again. Okay, so now that it's on, I'm going to let it set for another 8 to 10 minutes. Okay, so it's been 10 minutes, so I'm going to go ahead and take this off. I'm just using a baby wipe just to make sure that I get everything off. And as you can see, that's what your brows are gonna look like. So if you have like super thick brows, you can actually go through and trim them with these. I really don't need it. Um, and pretty much your brows are done. I'm actually going to henna my brows now, um, but obviously I'm using a different product for this but I like to do that when I do my brows like this just because it makes them look even better so I'll just show you how to do that if you want to but you don't have to because this does not they're two different products okay so I've had it like on for right at an hour so I'm going to go ahead and take it off I'm just using a baby wipe just so that I'm not like really wetting it too much and then after you're done with that my skin's red from rubbing it um but i'm going to put the what is it not that one the nourishing little gel stuff so i'm just taking this little thing right here i'm just going to put it on my brows just to finish it up Okay. 
And as you can see, that is the end results. Um, all I would really have to do is like my foundation. Um, I did use a, um, a cheek tint, so that's why my um, lips are a little pink in my cheeks. It's not red, it's just like a tint because when I put foundation over it, it looks really nice, but I probably won't be putting on makeup today. I'm just gonna leave myself like this, but that's how they turn out. It looks super pretty. And if you want to, you can dye your brows before doing the perm. Um, it just depends on what you wanna do, um, but you don't even have to do that. But that's what it looks like. But yeah, that completes this video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, God bless.